of the division series with four shutout innings in that extra inning win. Brantley, the second best average in the American League this year, hit 311. Strikes out. Good live fastball. Two of the yes. things to, to watch tonight. First pitch success has not been great. Coming into tonight's game, Altuve, Brantley, and Bregman have combined five for 36 in the ALCS. Fly ball into left. Back at the wall. This ball is gone. Bregman sends one out. And the Astros strike first in game four. Well, just what the doctor ordered. And they needed this badly. They needed to score. And they need to score a lot against this team that is just waiting to get to the plate in the Boston Red Sox. He's going to try to work low, throw a lot of breaking balls, and really try to mess up with the timing of the hitters. Here's Bogarts now. Does not have an RBI. Here it is, and Xander swings and drives one to left. High and deep. It is long gone out of Fenway Park in the Lansdowne Street. 2-1 Red Sox. Xander Bogarts with his third home run of the postseason. And the Red Sox gain the lead quickly. Xander touching them all. A high towering blast that was still going when it went over the National Car Rental sign. He's got RBIs now. He does. Here he comes. That is what a play by Bregman. Sensational. Alex Bregman homered in the top half of the first and in the bottom half makes this play advance to second and third. He's looking for a big hit. Here it comes from Pavetta. And Maldonado flies to center. Easy for Kike Hernandez. Into an out of trump pitch to Arroyo. Off the end of the bat. Going to be a tough play. Guriel, great play. Former third baseman in Cuba moves around really well. Has become an outstanding first baseman and to his right. Had to slide, made the stop, popped up, and then fed the athlete that is Zach Greinke for the out. And yet again, a starter for the Astros not able to get through three full. It's three games in a row now. The starter hasn't gotten through two. Here it is. And a swing and a miss struck him out. What a big out picked up by Brooks Raley. Two down. The 0-2 is skied into right. Tucker near the line, and what a job by Rayleigh. Back is the right-hander Pavetta, Chaz McCormick. Breaking ball, got him looking. Strikeout number three for Pavetta. Now Maldonado, 2-2 pitch. Maldonado hits it in the air to right. Pretty well hit over to his left. Renfro, two out. Here comes Altuve, 2-2 pitch. Rounded to third, Devers circles it, gloves, throws, and got him. What a play on both ends. Beautiful swipe at that one hop throw, and they get him. Devers throwing him out. Watch the right foot of Schwarber come off the bag when he received that throw that bounced in. The Astros did not challenge, and touch was Nick Pavetta tonight as he goes five through 65 pitches in his first career postseason start and gives way to the bullpen and Josh Taylor. Here's a ground ball by Brantley right into the teeth of the defense and the out at first. Here's an 0 1 from Taylor and a high fly ball into right. Another pop up. Another out. Two away and with Correa coming up. One and two. Here it is. Strike three called fastball. See ya. Correa is gone. What a job by Adovino. Garrett wins over. Fourth pitcher of the night for Boston. Deals with Kyle Tucker. Brings it. And a fly ball into center. Tucker got jammed a bit. Kike Hernandez, one out. Ground ball to Bogarts. Two out. Everybody standing at Fenway Park. Two and two. To end the inning. Number Houston in the eighth. Jose Altuve, who's 0 for 3. Pitch on the way. And Altuve drills it deep to left field. And you can kiss it goodbye. We're tied at two. Jose Altuve does it again. He tied game one with a two run homer. And he ties game four with a solo shot over the monster seats. That's 21 postseason homers now for Altuve. Third most all time. Nine Two game and Nathan Evaldi takes over. Carlos 0 for 3, 4 out of 15 in this LCS. Fly ball into right, pretty well hit. Carrying at the wall. It's one hop and off 
the wall. Correa will dig for second. It's a leadoff double for Houston. And in right field, you got to hit this a long way. And I'll tell you one thing. I I think if he gets out of the box thinking triple, he gets triple. I agree. And I don't think he thought this ball was going to get over the head of Renfro. And Evaldi, he was a strikeout pitcher, is I and one here. Here's the 0-2. Struck him out. One away and a big strikeout for Evaldi. Still at second, 2-2 two -two pitch. Two out. And he went back to the split. This time he delivered a beauty. And now Jason Castro, the Astros' final hope here in the top of the ninth. And that's lifted in the short right center for a base hit. Correa around third, he will score. Gurriel on his way to third, he's in safely. Jason Castro comes through, and the Astros lead it three to two in the ninth. And now with the bases loaded after a walk to Altuve, here's Brantley, and on the mound is Martin Perez. First pitch, and Brantley lines it toward right center field. That's down for a base hit. Here comes Gurriel, he scores. Castro scores. Altuve around third coming home. He scores as well. Brantley clears the bases with a three-run double. And the Astros lead it six to two. Alvarez one for three tonight, a single and a walk. First pitch, and Jordan lifts this one. That gets down in the shallow left for a base hit. Brantley around third and coming home. The throw to the plate by Verdugo up the third baseline. Brantley slides in ahead of Vasquez. It's tagged. Alvarez with an RBI single. It's seven to two, Astros, and they're headed for the exits in Boston. That's like a swinging bunt. Perez, that gets away. One run will score. That's Bregman coming to the plate. Alvarez will hold at third, and it's 8 to 2 for the 1 2 count. Pitch number 22. He does. Astros win at a final of 9 to 2, and they've evened this best of seven series two games apiece.